Merry Christmas! Welcome back to day 20, 15, 20, 20, 25 of the 25 Beers of Christmas. This is Craft Beers of Sydney and my name's Sam. Thank you very much for tuning in. Today is Christmas Day. Merry Christmas to you all and to you all. Have a, have a good one, right? So today's beer from the advent calendar, we're doing this on an iPhone today, just because it's a lot less hassle, a lot better quality. Here, look at this. It's got a picture of Santa on it. This is a, a Wassail Ale. And it's a collab with Beer Cartel. Merry Christmas to you all. And we're gonna give this a little drinky poos. But just before we do give this a little drinky poos, I'll show you what we're up to at the moment. How do we turn this around? I don't know, but you can turn this around. So that we'll just we'll just open this up. Turkey on the Barbie, not just the Barbie, turkey on the offset smoker. So today we are smoking a turkey. All right, how do we turn this around? I don't know, hang on. Oh, hang on. Here we go. So we have this bad man, which is a, apparently a collaboration with Beer Cartel. So Merry Christmas Beer Cartel. Thank you very much for saving a Christmas beer for Christmas Day. Is it going to be difficult pouring a beer with one hand straight in? Comment below. I know this is the absolute worst way to pour a beer. Look at the size of that head. But look at the colour of that beer. Let that settle down for a moment, just while we read this. It says, it's an ancient Yuletide toast to health and revelers in this festive season. Our wassail is inspired by traditional European winter ales. It's definitely not a traditional European winter here. Look at this, not a cloud in the sky. We are blessed. Australia is truly the lucky country. But it's a winter ale with an Australian twist. Woohoo! Perfect for drinking, just like Santa. When the job of delivering presents is done and it's best enjoyed for your feet up and paired with a Christmas ham or barbecue. Well, as I've said, there's a Christmas beer and we'll get this open. Look at that Christmas barbecue. Say barbecue a turkey, people. So, we'll just finish pouring this and then we'll give it the old uh, switcheroo and we'll give it some tasting. Look at that. Oh, yeah. Yummy. So, here we are. I've got my Santa hat on. Can you see that, bad boy? The Santa sombrero because it is super hot here today. Like, well, if I'm going to be outside barbecuing a turkey for four hours, I need plenty of drinks and plenty of shade. So, I've even commandeered a fan to blow on the barbecue to get that smoky vibes rolling through. But here's to a Christmas beer. Love you all. Oh yeah, it smells a bit like raspberry vibe. Not raspberry, raisiny. Bit brandy, bit Christmas puddingy, malty. Needs to get drunk. This isn't the first beer of the day, it's probably about the seventh. Merry Christmas. Oh, yeah. Now that's very good. I'm just gonna go back into the hut, into the shed. It's not really a shed, it's more of a laundry room. It means I can pop that down. I'm shirtless today. 
most days when this video has been recorded, well just before this bit video has been recorded, I've been shirtless. I hope it doesn't infringe any YouTube guidelines. Um, but I've always put a shirt on just for you. And I thought, you know what? Today, we'll give the boys and girls a little treat because I can't be bothered to put a t-shirt on to make this video. It's Christmas, so it's very good. Done in three gulps, pretty much. It does taste like Christmas. It's like really ailey. It's like sultanas and like boozy brandy sort of vibe in there. I don't have the can with me. I've left it out there, so I can't really tell you where it's from. But I can tell you it's very, very good. And as a end point to the 25 beers of Christmas, it's very Christmassy. When uh, Christmas beer sort of um, vibe. Anywho, I don't really know what I'm on about. I mean, that beer's nearly gone, so I'm already thinking about what next. Um, Nancy got me a growler. It's been sat under the Christmas tree for a week. <laughs> but a growler of Akasha, of Akasha Citrus IPA. Or it might be Modus Citrus IPA. I don't know. But I'm looking forward to smashing that out this afternoon. I wish all of you boys and girls a very Merry Christmas. Now you may or may not see me before the new year, but stay tuned because 2019 is going to be big things for this channel. We've got brews happening, we've got interviews with brewers, interviews with uh, bars lined up and loads of other stuff. So stick around. Thank you for staying through this 25 beers of Christmas. I understand at points it's been a little bit, a little bit rubbish, a little bit tedious, um, but yeah, we've had moments of gold. So we'll try to amplify those moments of gold and dissolve those moments of rubbishness in 2019. So thank you very much for watching. I'm wishing you a very merry christmas and a happy new year and we will see you very very soon on craft beers of sydney thank you very much for watching and goodbye